it's dark now. Alright. What else is going on in this shithole? Switch back to the... Oh, I only have three rounds. I only have eight rounds. I see the beltway is not doing pretty good. The freeway is all screwed up. Let's look at our world map. Local map, eh? That kind of does stuff. Super duper mart. There's some more buildings. That looks pretty fancy. What's that? Kind of looks like... Jesus. Like that giant Jesus in Brazil. Freeway underpass, overpass. This building does not look like it works anymore. I guess I will investigate just to be sure. Mm, nope. One of those Famous Washington, D.C. buildings with no doors in it. And you wonder why nothing gets done in Washington. There's no doors in the buildings. How do you get in? I bet that water is icky. Those monsters... Oh! They're gonna get me! Hello? What's the matter? Those... Things! They keep coming! They scare me! Make it stop! Uh... What's the problem? I can't help you. Those things! It's all their fault! They did this to us! Who is they? Alright. You won't leave me like all the other grown-ups. You... You can help me. Sure! <laughs> Sorry, kid. Help cause caps and you look pretty broke to me. You look like a tasty snack for a monster. Now let's not be an asshole to children. Even if they do sound like they're like... 18 years old. Those... big things. They're all over Greyditch. And they killed everyone. Greyditch, eh? Please, mister. Please find my papa. What is Greyditch? What happened here? It used to be kinda nice. No one bothered us there. I guess because we were so close to D.C. There were seven of us living there in tall, old brick houses. I think I'm the last one left. Those things took everyone else. That sounds... sad. Nah. People don't like to stay long in Great Itch. The D.C. ruins aren't a great place to make a home, you know. In fact, yeah, Papa I can was tell. talking about moving on soon. We've been here for maybe a year. Maybe if you... Had a shirt, you wouldn't be so lonely. Who else lived in Great Itch? Um, besides me and my papa, there was Doc Lesko, who stayed with us, and Will Brandis, and his mama and papa, too. The I, mama and the papas, eh? They're all gone now. Okay. Alright. What is ask it? You something else. Tell me more about the things attacking Great Itch. Well, they're big. Ugly things that crawl around on six legs. They six got legs, huge eh? Teeth and skitter around, grabbing everything in their path. Like My rad roaches. My would always say they're fucking ants. Well, that's what he used to call them anyway. Yuck. I just call them fire ants. You shouldn't use language like that. Is there any special way to hurt them? My papa had a gun. He said it hurt those things, but he said they were the dumbest fucking ants he ever saw. He kept telling everyone to shoot for their antenna. Whatever that means. You're not very bright, are you? Nah. No, those things started coming around only in the last few months. At first, they just crawled around outside our town. But later, they came into town. And, well, you know the rest. Okay. Let me ask you something right. else. Um, where's your house? 
Look for the house nearest to the billboard. That's sticking out of the ground. It's pretty close to the diner. You can't miss it. Thanks for the tip. What is this? Mind if I ask about some of the people who live there? Nah, go ahead. It's just nice to talk to anyone about stuff at all. Stuff and junk. Let's ask Lesko! He was a strange man. <laughs> he Papa some caps to help him build a shack and carry a bunch of junk into it. Papa called him an egghead, but his head was shaped regular, so I didn't get it. Yeah, sarcasm is lost on this generation. Where did Dr. Lesko stay? He spent all of his time in that shack next door to my house. Every time I'd sneak in there, he'd be sitting at that funny looking TV machine with the green words pushing buttons. Yeah, I've seen a couple of those. Do you have any idea what Dr. Lesko was doing in Grey Ditch? Nah, he was a nice man, but he never wanted to play with me very much, and we barely talked. No, nobody all wants I know to play with me. Is he was all gone when the ants started showing up. I think they got him too. Uh oh. Did Dr. Lesko have any weird stuff in his place? I don't know. All kinds of doohickeys. Boxes with lots of lights, some funny glass bottles. Oh wait, he had a big, clunky, shiny man too. That was kind of neat. Like a Cylon? Yeah. How about the Brandis family? Well, there is Will. He was sort of my friend. And then there was his dad and his mom. Where did the Brandises live? Right across the street, actually. It was pretty swell having someone to hang out with so close <laughs> by. Right across the street. So you and Will were good friends. Yeah. Will was super nice to me. He was like a year older than me, I think. He even shared his comic books with me. Comic we books, eh? pretty much every bit of Grey Ditch we could find. I think that's why the ants don't bother me. I have good hiding spots. Cool. How about Will's parents? Well, his mom was nice too. She was kind of quiet, but she always took care of me and my papa when we came over. I think she was sad that my mom was gone. Will's dad was... Well, I don't want to be mean, but he was kind of scary. Yeah? How so? He was like always watching me and my dad real careful like he didn't trust us or something. He always kept staring at us from the windows of his house and typing stuff into his TV box. Hmm. Will said his dad was like an old soldier or something, but he didn't like doing that stuff so he quit. Yeah, that sounds like post-traumatic stress whatever. Yeah? How do I get out of this All right. dialogue what is tree? It? I'll go look for your father. You will? Really? Thanks a whole lot. My house is the one closest to the huge sign and the old diner. Please, find my papa and make him come back. Look, anything else you can do to help might save lives. Uh, you should hide. Well, there is the personal shelter next to the old diner. Papa always said to stay away from it, but I guess it's supposed to be safe. I'll head over there and wait inside. Hurry back. Yeah, sure. I don't have enough fathers to look for. And there he goes. So apparently I'm somewhere, and that somewhere is Grey Ditch. Look at that kid run. Okay, then. That's over that way. Kind of want to see what happens if I jump in the water, though. You want to see? Whee! Oh. I can swim! I can... Take a lot of radiation, but I can swim! Wow, that's cool. This is like the least last thing I was expecting from Fallout. The ability to swim. Something you couldn't even do in most of the Grand Theft Auto games. Hello. Wow, that's it wacky looking thing. Bzz. 
Okay, let's use the thingamajig. Should you have my lasers? I'm a fire in my laser. Maybe I'll shoot you in the torso. I have a better chance of hitting you there. Critical hit. Torso. Let's bravely run away, because there's a couple of them, I think. Wow, those are not good. Bzzz. Please stop shooting your things at me. I'm going to run over here now. Now I have plenty of action points. Torso, left legs. Hmm. Shoot you in the head. There we go. Ten experience points, that's all I get. Oh. Fire my ray gun, I can't hit the damn thing. I kind of waddle when I walk. Ooh. Maybe if I shot for the middle of them, that might help. Ooh, I don't feel so good. I better run away. This scary thing is doing stuff. You have a lot of hit points, don't you? My aim is crap, isn't it? Die, you son of a bitch. Must have taken head damage. Wow, even my Pip Boy is blurry. Ah, that's kind of cool. All better. The future is great that way. So now I'm over here. guess. What am I doing over here now? Let's look at our quest data thing for that thingamajig. Find Brian Wilkes father. Show location. Uh, I'm going the wrong way for that. I'm over here now. These storefronts don't look very good. Tree is dead. Hmm. I sense hostiles. Let's use the hunting rifle. Oh, you shoot like a person who can't shoot. Did you miss again? Oh. I'm gonna die, aren't I? Oh, come on. I'm getting shot again. I can hear it. Hunting rifle, eh? Stop shooting at me! This is an iron storm. When you turn up. Sam Warwick? Who the hell is that? I should use some stim packs though. 
Probably not that many, but oh well. Now I can bravely charge at him and shoot him. Switch to the hunting rifle. Where'd you go, Sam Warwick? Hey, I just shot you in the head and you didn't even notice. You big jerk. What are you, like a boss or something? Well, let's use the uh, laser pistol while we're at close range. Whatever. Who was that guy? Sam Warwick. Well, I've got all this stuff now. Okay, then. Let's see if he had anything interesting to be equipped. Sunglasses. Oh, I can't wear sunglasses and a helmet. What kind of future is this? I didn't want that. Chinese crappy pistol. I sure do have a lot of laser pistols, though. Hmm. I should probably be using this pistol as my laser pistol. Instead of the other one, because it's in better condition. Okay, well, that guy's dead. What else is going on here? Do, 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 do. Maybe I will save. Save game. Some barricades. Some guy's got like a machine gun. Talon Company Merc. What the hell is that? Mean? Leads, I can kill him. Maybe I should be using my pistol instead because my energy skill is not so very good. Let's do that instead. I might actually hit something I'm aiming at instead. Not. Oh, come on, man. Run for cover. He's dead now. You have an assault rifle. Give me that. I want that. Over encumbered and cannot run. I don't care. Hey, there's a guy down there, hey? I have an assault rifle. What do you have? Leather armor. Damage resistance 15. It's even better than my armored jumpsuit. How about that? Drop these stupid. Ooh. Damage resistance, 15. Damage resistance... Oh. Leather armor is better than Talon combat armor. That doesn't make any sense. Okay. We'll drop that. What else am I carrying that weighs so much? Oh, a 32 pistol. I didn't even know that was a thing. 556 millimeters. That's pretty goddamn big. Chinese pistols are stupid. I'll drop these knives. That's right, I said knives. That pipe is kind of valuable, though. Mm. 
Man. Oh. What are you doing all this crap for? Another belt? I don't need that. Medical brace? Probably not. Ammo. Whatever. Cool. I got the uh, KF-7 Soviet now. Doing it all Call of Duty style. What's going on down here? Oh, hey, look. I bet these crates have something in them. Cool. That's cool. <gasps> Five millimeter rounds. Oh, that's probably not the kind that I want, is it? No, it's not. Shh, grenade box. I bet there's grenades in the grenade box. Okie dokie. Oh, it's an old truck, eh? Hostile. Oh, that's a robot. Continuous resistance is unlawful. It's a robot that's got like super duper shootness capabilities. Let's switch to the blue stupid little laser pistol. Do not be alarmed, order will be restored soon. Efficient battery energy cells. Oh, I'm over encumbered, can't run. That's like the story of this game so far, man. Alright, now what is encumbering me? Oh, fission battery weighs a lot. Let's drop that. Like it's hot. Like it's hot fishing. Get it? This place is all crappy. I wish I had some water to drink. Hello? Destroyed places. Worn out faces. Etc., etc. What is this thing? Some kind of industrial complex, eh? It's kind of cool, I guess. Do 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 do. There's an old uh, car. Something bad just happened. I think I got grenaded. Okay then. Uh, I think I'm gonna wrap it up for this time. Cause I don't want to be grenaded by grenaders. Okay, till the next time I will see you around. Thank you for watching! If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, or subscribe. Also check out my other recent videos. And if you'd like, you can pledge to sponsor me at patreon.com forward slash L1011widebody.